Dream AI was launched by a few of my students working together. It was their second project, and because I feel like they already had one initiative under their belt, the second one, which we call a month-long project, just went way smoother. In a few words, Dream AI was a four-day virtual hackathon held over Zoom to teach middle schoolers about AI and its applications. After attending talks and listening to guest speakers from universities like Stanford and UT Austin, each middle schooler, yep, you heard that right, middle schooler, was tasked with generating their own pitch for an idea that utilized AI technology. From an outsider's perspective, this project went incredibly well. There were over a dozen middle schoolers who attended and I was extremely impressed with the quality of ideas they came up with. I'll never forget this. One student described using AI to operate drones so that elderly people could get access to their prescriptions delivered right to their doorstep. Honestly, I almost pulled out my wallet and just invested right there. I mean, it's pretty ingenious, right? Especially considering this student was in middle school. I mean, when I was in middle school, I was binge watching anime. Meanwhile, these kids are just drumming up billion dollar startup ideas. <laughs> Interest. Pretty much all the team members had done some form of coding and were interested in computer science. But what was even more important was the fact that they were invested in teaching it to others. In fact, I would argue that this team was actually more interested in the actual education and proliferation of this knowledge than the actual AI concepts. I'm really proud of this team because they were interested in doing something good, something that transcended borders. And what better way to do that than through a virtual camp? After all, there are no borders in cyberspace. Moving on to people and legitimacy. For this initiative, I'm going to group these two factors together since I felt that one of the smartest ways this team made their hackathon stand out was by inviting esteemed guest speakers from prestigious universities. One of the biggest advantages about inviting guest speakers is that it's actually not all that hard. If you invite around 10 potential guest speakers, usually one or two will say yes. And even better if you know them, if they're a friend of a friend, a mutual friend, an acquaintance. I mean, Dream AI basically just had four or five guest speakers and two of them were me and my buddy Tarun. <laughs> Next up, we have you for uniqueness. So I don't think the idea of a hackathon is all that new, original, unique. However, by targeting middle schoolers, using a virtual format, and focusing on AI concepts, the combination of these three elements, in my opinion, made the event, the project, way more refreshing and exciting. These administrative and logistical choices also help the team expand their reach and more importantly, challenge the assumption that AI is too complicated for 10-year-old kids. Turns out, it's not. By making AI approachable and flipping that preconceived notion on its head, I really think that the Dream AI team was able to build something truly impressive. I already mentioned this previously, but I also really enjoyed the fact that the kids were tasked with creating something on their own after learning about these basic AI concepts. Personally, I thought the pitches and ideas were one of the most interesting and unique parts. For social impact, I'm just going to read from the Dream AI website. It says, our goal is to empower students of color to explore computer science and affirm the students that already have sparks of interest, specifically in AI. With our diverse recruiting for this event, we will be able to try and make the future of computer science and AI as diverse as possible. By planting the seeds of interests in middle school, underrepresented students, will be more encouraged to pursue an AI and computer science related career. I mean, yeah, this is honestly a really big problem in the computer science field. By specifically stating this was their directive early on, the Dream AI team and program is able to portray themselves as very knowledgeable, very empathetic, very aware, and very genuine. If you guys are having trouble coming up with an idea for a project, I wholeheartedly recommend doing a virtual boot camp. You can even start by hosting weekly one or two hour workshops. This is like your weekend project. Then create a more formal program once you guys have a dedicated audience. The benefit of doing something like this is that we're able to eliminate many of the physical complexities and logistics, which we will soon see in Cookies for Kids. At the end of the day though, the ball is in your court and whatever initiative you decide to go through with is cool with us. Just make sure you execute.